Hello everyone, Maker Myers here, and in this video I'm going to show you how to attach a photo or a video in Google Classroom to one of your assignments as you're submitting it. So here I have an example class, um, and if I go to my classwork I see, hey, I need to submit a photo or video. So as I view the assignment, you'll see at the top right hand corner where it says your work, you can add or create um, a document of some sort to attach to this assignment. And if you click on that button, you'll see you can either attach things from your Google Drive, you can attach a link, you can attach a file, or you can create a new Google Doc, Google Slide, or Sheet, or Drawing, and submit that for your assignment. Now, for this video, I'm going to show you how to do a photo or a video, but this is good to know um, regardless of what you're trying to submit. There's lots of options here. So first let's take a look at Google Drive. So let's say you have already created the photo or the video maybe on a your phone, you took a picture of it, you can then upload it to your Google Drive and then when I click Google Drive here and click on my drive I now can see all of the files that are in my drive. So in this little demo I've got a photo here that's a 3D selfie. It's a, an image, um, it's a screenshot actually of a 3D selfie of me which was kind of fun. Um, and then this is a video that I took, it's actually one of these tutorials that I uploaded to my Google Drive. And so with this um, I can select whichever one I want to attach. So let's say I'm going to do the picture, I hit add and now that picture is a, will, once it's done uploading, attach as my work. So now it's uploaded and I've got my image and if I click turn in it'll then submit that image to my teacher um, for the assignment. Um, I can do the same thing so if I click X I'll then cancel it out. Um, I could do the same thing for a video from my drive and then add it there. This will take a little bit longer because it's a big, oh maybe not, so it'll take as a bigger file and you can attach multiple so I could actually attach both of them from my Google Drive and it'll work. And like I said when I click turn in now all of a sudden those will be submitted to my teacher. So if you are taking pictures or videos from a cell phone from it, for example it's really easy to do that. Upload it to your Google Drive from your cell phone and then in here you can just select it from your Google Drive and um, you're good to go. So you also can add or create a link. So maybe you have your video on YouTube or you're as part of the assignment you're supposed to find a video on YouTube or find a specific website or whatever. You can then uh, paste that link in here and it will submit that link to your teacher. So let's say I uh, uploaded a video to YouTube of um, some sort of work. So I have the video tutorials I made earlier. So let's say I want to actually show my teacher um, this tutorial on posting videos to YouTube. So I can copy this link and then paste it in here and then hit add link and then when I submit it it will have that YouTube video or it could be a link to wherever um, in regards to whatever you're wanting to do for the assignment but if you have something on YouTube in the context of video um, you can then submit your YouTube video via that link. You also can just select file and if you do file then you can go in and upload a file from your computer. So if you know where that video or photo is, oops, so like here I've got these videos, I could just drag it over here and it will add it to your uh, submission and then you hit upload and it will upload that file um, or you just instead, so I'm going to cancel that real quick, or instead you could select files from your device and then it will bring up the little screen where you then navigate through your computer and figure out where the file is and attach it there. 
So you can use any of those methods to attach photos or videos to an assignment. And then if you want, if, in different contexts, you could have students submit documents, slide sheets, or drawings, or you as a student could submit a document, a slide, a sheet, or a drawing. And then when you hit turn in, it'll say, okay, turn in your work. Three attachments will be submitted. And you can verify, yep, those are the ones I want to submit, and hit turn in. And then those um, files will be submitted to your teacher as um, your work for that assignment. So hopefully this helps and have a wonderful day.